I have been living in Yeoju for almost two years and one of the things that I enjoy doing on the weekends or after work is going to cafes. So I wanted to share some of my favorite ones here in Yeoju with you and I will link each cafe's Instagram down below in the description box. The desserts at this cafe are the best of all these cafes in my opinion. They offer quite a range of different beverages. The space is relatively small since it's locally owned. Since the cafe is so small, I've gotten to know the staff. It's so nice to go to a cafe where the staff recognizes you and knows your signature drink. I ordered a watermelon juice and a ginger cookie. The decor creates a peaceful vibe along with the calm music. The cafe is nice when it's empty to study or work because the Wi-Fi is so fast. When it's busy, it serves as a nice place to chat and spend time with friends. The cafe is located in a neighborhood near a small park, so many of the customers are families from that area. I love all the plants that they have here too. The cafe just has an overall peaceful atmosphere that many of the commercial cafes lack. I think that's why I enjoy this cafe so much because it's a family business. The owner is always rotating the cookies, cakes, and bread that are offered. Cafe Woods is aesthetically pleasing, but it's an inconvenient location if you don't own a car. The cafe is spacious and well lit. It's a popular place to come. They had a small selection of desserts that looked very appetizing. Their beverage list is a variety of options ranging from tea to coffee. On the roof, there are tables for those that want to sit outside. I tend to prefer cafes that have more separation between the tables, but overall, I really like this place. I got passion fruit aid and Nazira got grapefruit aid and then we got a pound cake. The food and drinks were quite delicious and fresh. The music is cheerful and upbeat, which adds to the chill atmosphere of the cafe. The decor is tasteful and minimalistic with pastel and neutral tones. It's an ideal place to come and spend a few hours after a meal. All's Coffee is a small cafe located on the other side of the river. Similar to previous cafes, it also has a decent variety of drinks to choose from. There are lots of plants decorating the space. The area may be small, but not many customers come, so it's perfect for studying. The area is quiet and allows one to relax. All the times that I've been to this cafe, there was a good selection of music playing. Last time that I was here, there was a movie playing on the wall from the movie projector. This time, I bought a Jeju Tangerine Aid. It was refreshing and a perfect choice after a day of work. Everything from the cup to the napkin was visually pleasing. I enjoyed seeing different flower arrangements at each table. I only wish that this cafe was closer to the downtown area since it's near to the outskirts of Yoju. This is the newly opened second Good Simple Cafe. It is located on the other side of the river. It offers many beverages and fresh desserts. The decor is very similar to the main branch. I ordered a scone and Earl Grey tea this time. 
Many families and students come here to hang out. Blue Hara is located approximately a block away from Good Simple. Many of the locals in this area come here to grab a drink or study. As you can see, the seating allows for more privacy, which is ideal when studying or trying to get work done. This cafe offers many drinks and food options. The decor is more vintage, which is different from many of the modern cafes. I got an Earl Grey tea. This cafe is quite popular and features a lot of outdoor and in indoor seating options. It's a great place to relax after dinner. This cafe is high on my list and I come here frequently. It features a beautiful outdoor seating area. This is my ideal place because it has so much space between the tables. It's perfect for working or chatting with friends. The outlay is visually pleasing as well. The cafe offers a good selection of drinks and dessert. This time I ended up ordering a mint frappe. The cafe can get quite busy in the afternoons. The music selection is adequate. The decor is unlike any other cafe I've been to. This cafe is located across the river. It's relatively new to Yoju. The cafe has an extensive drink menu and some desserts that smell amazing. The design is simplistic and modern. There's an elevator to the roof, and this area is quite nice at night and during the sunny days. It's a good location to spend time with friends. The tables have a good amount of space between them. It's a nice place to work and enjoy their amazing playlist. I came here to get some work done and I love the chill environment. I also have to say that they made a killer iced tea. I have to add that I now want the mirror like this. Cafe Bene is the main place I come to with my friends to hang out after a meal because it's downtown. They serve drinks, desserts, and meals. I come here so often that the staff recognizes me. It's a popular place among high school students. They can often be seen here studying away. Although the space is open, it's generally quiet, which is perfect for studying. They also have a great music playlist. This area is, was surprisingly open, which usually it isn't. They don't clean the tables outside, so I've never sat out here. The seats here are really comfortable. I've seen students fall asleep here. I definitely recommend their apple cinnamon tea that they sell. This is the original and main location of Cafe Good Simple. It's conveniently located near the bus terminal. The owner can often be found here. He's quite popular on YouTube making videos about recipes, cafe life. The decor is simple yet beautiful and the cafe is quite small. It's popular since it's well located. It can get noisy because of how small the space is, but you will still find people studying here. The drinks and desserts are fantastic here since he makes all of them. The music is very calming here as well. Lastly, this is Cafe Day One. 
It's also located near the bus terminal. Since it's locally owned, it is also on the smaller side. They sell some great drinks and offer some desserts. It can get pretty noisy because it's so small. I really like how minimalistic the design is here. They're always playing such good music here. Students often come here to study. With your drink, they are always giving a complimentary sweet. Normally, I don't get drinks or desserts with dairy because I'm lactose intolerant. This time I took a chance and got the matcha latte. It was delicious. Thank you guys so much for watching and see you soon.